Hey guys, Q here, and this is round one of the 2019 Field of Honor season Masters League. Uh, as you can see, we're fairly evenly matched. Uh, we've got a buttload of legend legendary ones, a uh, couple legendary twos, one two legendary threes, and one legendary four. And it, they have roughly the same. Plus, I'm a level 30. But anyway, first thing I'm doing here is I'm actually trying to get the Blessing Tower. I think just with my 1,500 troops, 15, uh, 1.5 million troops, I can send them all to this Blessing Tower and hold it against all of them uh, unless they gang up with a rally. But there's more important buildings that they should be rallying against other than, uh, other than a Blessing Tower. So I think this is going to be a good strategy as, again, I'm not even 30, sorry, I'm castle level 28 they have a castle level 30 which also means he has uh, access to level 10 troops while i only have access to level 9 but oh and see there he is he just uh, uh legendary one just popped over and tried to take it but i had i had sent a couple dispatches in and he failed because of it so i'm just trying to really quickly load up this blessing tower with all of my troops i'm not really sure why my max <clears throat> my max account for the building is 1,250,000 as opposed to 1,500,000. I need to figure out which building to upgrade to try and to keep that number high. But So he's scouting me. Uh, as you can see, I'm just trying to fill it up, send as all the troops that I can. I got plenty of speeds, luckily. And so I'm, they're going there, I'm making sure. I'm like, crap, he's, scout, he's tr gonna scout my castle, so I wanna make sure that I fog. All right, so it's all loaded up. <clears throat> now let's see. Oh, yep, it's a legendary one. Okay. <laughs> Our leader, Arisha, there. She's got. She's working three devices on this field of honor because uh, her husband fell asleep and uh, one of the other guys just couldn't be on at this time, so she's rocking three devices. And I'm just like, oh. But she she did a great job. Um, so now I'm just looking around. Again, I'm only a castle level 28. I, I'm the lowest level out of everyone in this field of honor, so I'm not going to be much help. So I'm focusing on my building. I have another 200, 250,000 troops in my castle that I can send to rallies or help defense. So I'm just searching around. So let's see here. Uh, checking out hospitals. Checking out the rallies, making sure that I'm not being rallied against. Uh, looking okay, so we got this crystal Vonner. That's a good one making sure he has a lot a good amount of troops in there I sped this part up because it's really just me going around checking buildings see if anyone needs help uh, You can see he's scouting around trying to find since he can't take my building and I notice we don't have the left crystal of honor So we're definitely gonna have to have to take that if we want to guarantee the wind. Oh, he did attack me uh and failed quite miserably <laughs> tried to scout my castle nope so i don't know oh no that was the original attack uh so i it is it is full after that again i sped this up just trying to watch uh trying to watch the rallies trying to watch the the battles making sure that i'm still full there because I found that one of the e one of the easiest ways to lose a building is when your attention is split, when you're focused on something else and someone, because there's so much red going on, you know, so many rallies, so many attacks that you're focused on one rally and then someone else is doing their own thing. So I'm checking this, uh, making sure that all the buildings that we own are fully loaded up. back to my building and he's scouting my castle <clears throat> so uh, I don't want him to take out my remaining troops uh, so I tried to use a shield and then totally forgot they're in a building I can't shield <laughs> and I think this is the part where he actually sends an attack against me let's see <clears throat> yep okay so there it is There it is. Uh, so I'm sending my troops away. I realized I could have just sent it to a random plot on the map, but instead I sent him to another building just so that when his attack lands, I don't lose any troops. I want to save these remaining 250,000 troops 
to reinforce my blessing tower if it becomes uh, uh, if it gets attacked or rallied that I can quickly just fill it right back up again not give them a chance to hit with multiple rallies again luckily I have all the speeds I need so shouldn't be too much of a problem and then oh yeah the mercenary knights forgot about that because we didn't take the hall of knights which the mercenary knights aren't really a priority I mean that building is only valuable only really valuable for the two points the two points it gives you every what five minutes every two minutes um, you know the crystal of honors giving eight points the the hall of honor giving 15 points so that at this point I see that they still have the hall of honor and a uh, and a crystal so I'm watching the points here and they're winning so I'm like okay we, we got to get our shit together we didn't we didn't hold the buildings we needed to off the bat <clears throat> and this uh, in our alliance we kind of just took a wing it approach to this battle as opposed to coming up with an actual strategy we kind of just each had our own and you know we do really well with teamwork uh, eh, not so well with agreeing on strategy and so this was just a fucking wing it strategy. We're just like, you know what? Just do it. So this one's calling for reinforcements. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna recall the troops now that the attack has land landed, and let's see if anyone need these troops. Yep, defense failed. What do you? I guess my traps kill them. Look at those stats for a legendary one. Look at those crap stats he has. 174 attack infantry. I'm at 238. Come on, bro. So I'm just making sure everything's still in place. My troops are coming back. Again, this is just sped up. <clears throat> Here we go. There's the speed. So Pioneer Camp is being rallied. I'm checking out where people are posting stuff. And I'm like, okay, my troops are coming back. That's just the mercenary knights. So, you know, I think I'm just going to take this hit, checking rallies, moving around. Again, th there, was, there was definitely some points where I wasn't doing anything, doing much during this, right? I was keeping an eye on things. See, they're, they're talking strategy right there, and I'm going to hop in where I'm needed. But obviously, I only got... Uh, T9 troops. You know, I got good stats, but T9 troops. So I'm looking, okay, they're gonna try and take the Pioneer Camp. I don't give a crap about the Pioneer Camp. It's two points, and that's the only thing it's useful for. <laughs> I'm looking at the points, and we're, we're lacking. We're lacking, so we're like, crap. And I see Yummy, she's saying, you know, she set a rally to take over the crystal. So I'm like, okay, I'm gonna take some time. I'm not gonna send my troops just yet to see if you know, to give the other legendaries, the people with the better troops, a chance to dispatch it into Yummy's Rally. But we do need to take that crystal if we want to pull the win. So I'm looking around, watching the Mercenary Knights, watching the rallies, watching the attacks. So I'm like, okay, I don't want to get hit by this Mercenary Knight. 27 seconds left in the rally. Let's do this. There's still some room left. Let's see if I can help. All right, five minutes. How much time? 18 seconds left. Okay, so I need to get my timer down less than 18 seconds. Uh, two seconds. Sure, that'll work. <laughs> I think there was a little bit of lag there. I just got a little heavy on the uh, button. All right, then let's go see how this attack works. Let's head over to the Crystal Honor. Looks like they did reinforce. Oh, it's speeding up. All right, let's see that hit. Oh yeah, there we go. <clears throat> and so we took that Crystal of Honor, and that's what we're going to need to win this. We need at least both Crystal of Honors and a buttload of the buildings. Checking out those, those stats. We took out about half of them. We only got 158,000 wounded. So that, that, was, that was enough to get the win and take over the building. Now they're, now they're scouting the building we just took over. Oh, <laughs> apparently Yummy used Rafe as a as a rally leader. Because <laughs> I don't think Rafe works on buildings, only castles. Or Rafe's ability, for that matter. 
looking at the pioneer camp i'm like you know we really should just let them take the pioneer camp it's far from them but we, we shouldn't be wasting our troops on the pioneer camp and i just hate that little red circle down at the bottom uh i like to see you know when a new thing shows up like if i get attacked and when i'm not paying attention that red circle is what's going to let me know that i got attacked so i like to keep that notification clear all right we've got both crystal of honors looking at the points 375 on 201 we're gonna have to if we just held this we might win if we could hold all of our buildings like this we might win but we really should take one or two more i'm gonna help reinforce this crystal of honor just because we need to hold it all right making sure that my uh my uh blessing tower is full Checking rallies. Let's see, they're rallying against Crystal of Honor, but it's pretty full. I still think we should just let them take that Pioneer camp. Mickey Ellis probably should have pulled. She's a legendary one. We could use her troops. Uh, we could use her troops in a better area. For instance, taking the the turret for the Crystal, the other Crystal of Honor. Now you can see that someone uh, took the turret for our Crystal of Honor there, which is nice. And I'm just gonna, I'm just probably not gonna say much during this section. I think this is a several minute speed. Uh, something like four minutes mercenary nights. I'm just letting myself burn, but I'll just uh, sit here for a second <clears throat> And commentate when we start doing shit again. We're about you know 20 minutes in So this is kind of the lull where people are re rechecking their strategies and Deciding what we need to do from here What's a drop of water from a daughter made of glass Frail and poised on a question when there's nothing left to ask So 
So as you can see here, um, I'm looking at the points and doing the mental math in my head <clears throat> and really seeing that if we just hold these buildings, we can really, we can win. But DK, he's, he's just hungry for blood. <laughs> yeah, Mars and DK are both just like, but I want to kill him. I'm like, hey, you guys do what you do. I'm just saying we should probably focus on defense and we'll win. Simple as that. If we focus on defending the den, uh, defending the buildings we're on, we will win. But you guys do what you want to do. So right now I'm sending out scouts as well, just trying to get counts, see if there's any buildings that were left empty by the enemy. Because once you occupy a building, you will still get the points, even if you haven't... Um, if you if you have no troops there and that's how some people can take multiple buildings with their limited amount of troops which is a good thing to do on things like pioneer camps you fill it you take it over you fill it up you completely occupy it and then just uh recall your troops and put them to better use somewhere else you'll get points while you know as long as the enemy doesn't realize that you abandoned Alright, so here we go, they rallied our crystal, and we won, barely, but we won. So I'm just like, I got 7,000 troops I can heal, I actually I didn't even see the count, I just saw I had troops in my hospital, I'm like, heal them, heal them quick, I'm, I gotta help. I didn't realize that I only had 7,000 troops, not gonna be much help. Really, someone else should be reinforcing this so they don't get more attacks and rallies off it. Obviously, Yummy One is still, you know, still outclassing the enemy there, but. <laughs> yeah, mercenary, get rid of that notification. And now, if you look at our points, are real close, so I'm constantly checking the map making sure they don't take a new building that we're getting those points and we should be in the lead very soon <laughs> checking around that legendary one that failed to take me out what a what a punk <laughs> Alright, so, I mean, we got most of the buildings. We're, if we hold these, we'll definitely win. You know, we're seven points behind right now. It only refreshes every two minutes, so you see their points go up 15 because of the Hall of Honor there. And you see ours going up by those twos. Boom, boom. And then we should get those eights soon as well. <clears throat> and people, you know, people like DK... Uh, or I think Mr. Enemy is saying, well, how come we're not winning? We have all the buildings. I'm like, look, it updates every two minutes. Uh, don't worry about it. As long as we have the buildings, you know, there's still plenty of time left in this uh, what, 17 minutes. Yeah. As long as we hold these buildings, it only gives us the points uh, every two minutes or so. Oh, they rallied the crystal again. We are, uh, we're losing counts on there. Someone really should reinforce that crystal besides me because my troops are very limited. All right, let's check what's still here. I copied the coordinates. I'm like, come on. I'm thinking I can, I can pull from my blessing tower and, and send to the crystal of honor. So I pulled from the Blessing Tower because we really want to keep this Crystal of Honor. So I'm going to send my troops here to reinforce it because one more rally and Yummy will be kicked out with only 600,000 troops in there even though she's T11 <clears throat> and she's got good stats. I'm 
It's a good thing I hoarded all these speeds, although I am being a little excess with them. So now that I pulled, I still want to send some troops back to the Hall of Blessing, but my weaker troops. Uh, Blessing Tower, Hall of Blessing. <laughs> I'm like, shit, uh, 15, uh, 17, 15, I don't know why I just sent 17,000 troops there. So I'm like, okay, I've got about 170,000 in that Hall of Blessing. I can, I could probably take a solo attack, not a rally, so I just gotta keep an eye. Okay, this is, this is gonna be fully loaded. We need this Crystal of Honor fully loaded, so. Since the other legendaries are, since the other, you know, the more powerful people in our alliance are distracted by other things, I'm gonna do it. And this is, this is where I see where we might have lost it because, because we're all so distracted by different things, we're not holding the buildings we're in charge of. Now, again, Elysia is completely right. We did work with a lot of good teamwork, we did a lot of rallies, and took over most of the buildings. You can see our points are now ahead of South King. You know, they can have the Hall of Honor because... <clears throat> because we're trying to take over the Hall of Honor, we'll lose most everything trying to take over the Hall of Honor. There we go, I filled up the crystal. Don't pay attention to that. Um, looks like they're still attacking that crystal of honor. I'm burning. I have 178,000 troops. I'm hoping that in my Blessing Tower, let's see, they're scouting my Blessing Tower. I don't know why I didn't reinforce my Blessing Tower here, because obviously I'm way outclassed. Um, I should have reinforced it a bit more to be able to take solo, solo attacks. Yep, attack your Blessing Tower, and I'm like, oh shit, shit, shit. Said, uh, go, go, go. Uh, and he's, uh, he got there before me. And so I just wasted, I just attacked him with like a 50,000 dispatch. Oh, crap. And see, I was distracted. I was too busy trying to reinforce the blessing, to, uh, the, the, the yook, my blessing tower. I was too busy trying to reinforce the, the crystal towers that I wasn't paying attention enough to my blessing tower, and they snuck in and took it out. So I'm like, crap, alright, first let's get rid of these, check the battle report, there we go, and, yep, okay, yep, alright, he took it, he's only got about 200,000 in there, but he knows that I can't take him out, ah, so I'm like, alright, well I can't take it, maybe I can help reinforce somewhere, checking my heels, no, now, we're at the point, 12 minutes left, we're still win, even if they take that Blessing Tower. But, as long as they don't take another building, particularly a crystal. The blessing Tower only gives two points, so we don't need to worry about that. As long as we focus on holding the buildings we have. And then, DK sets a rally. I'm like, oh, uh, okay. <laughs> That's a thing. And they're scouting our Crystal of Honor again. And so we got Defense Mars is being rallied. So I'm like, maybe I can help him hold that turret. <clears throat> and, yep, see people are attacking the, the Crystal of the Blessing Tower. They got it weak, a little bit weaker. But we also got a rally set up for it. So if we're going to take it, we're going to take it. But as long as we hold the buildings we have... I'm like, I'm checking my defense, I'm just like, yeah, do I want to put out the fires? I don't think, by the time this, this round ends, I won't be kicked out. Or I don't even know what happens when your defense goes. You probably get kicked out of FOH. So I'm like, okay, I'm going to reinforce this turret, help Mars make sure, because he's about to take a rally. He's attacking my castle. You know what? You can go screw yourself, man. <laughs> Ten minutes left. Thirty-three points ahead. 
Hold the buildings. Hold the buildings. <clears throat> That's all we need to do and we will win. See, now we're 50 points ahead. It's just the, it, you know, we just gotta wait for those refreshes. 60 points out of 50. So I'm going around, checking rallies, let's see. Uh, we got the turret, Hall of Honor, or no, hospital. Just sending out scouts, seeing if any, if they abandon anything to, you know, if they, if they recall troops to join a rally, we can take over the building that they recalled from. And defense failed. What, what failed? What failed? Okay. Um, uh, let's see. Okay, pioneer camp. They took a pioneer camp. They're making last ditch efforts. We're only 30 points ahead, 40 points ahead, 35. Um, and, oh, wait, what happened there? Yeah, we took the Pioneer Camp back. Beautiful. Okay. I think I was trying to recall my troops from that turret. Uh, yeah, they attacked my castle. Look at those shit stats. These legendaries not putting... <coughs> Not putting effort in their stats and quite annoying. Oh, and look at that. We got the blessing tower. What what happened there? Fucking DK, that rally. <laughs> well done, DK. You just secured the win for us. They can't get points from that uh, from that rally. I think we took or from that blessing tower, we took the pioneer camp. Even if they take another building, we got the win. Unless they take like four or five and they get that um, that occupy bonus, but we got just under six minutes left. Checking my burn status. Uh, four thousand defense left. Five minutes it goes down kind of a lot. Yeah, look at that. They got fourteen people. We've got thirteen. But look at those telepoints they used. They weren't, you know, they weren't, they weren't putting any effort into holding, but they really gave us a fight. This is still a close battle, but now we're just getting that lead up. You know what? Oh, and they just occupied the, uh, the Pioneer building. Somebody needs speed, although I don't know what, so I'm, I'm trying to figure out so who, the, who the heck needs speed. You know what? Mid's got it. I'm sure Mid's got it. Uh, you know, there's, there's a lot of people just checking around the reds, making sure there's, let's see, the rallying, the pioneer camp, but what, Mars is holding the pioneer camp, and there are plenty of re resources, uh, reinforcements there. I don't think they're going to take it. Let's see, who is this? This is uh, Hades. <clears throat> All right, let's see. Let's see if that rally takes out the Pioneer Camp. Oh, yeah. And there it is. We're done. They're done. <laughs> Soon we'll occupy that uh, Blessing Tower because DK's troops are uh, definitely legit. So we we got the win here. I'm I'm looking at or I, I was trying to click on Alliance to just see if there were any scout numbers out there, but we really did pull together. We we didn't even have our shit together in the beginning, and we were losing. Um, we had some good rallies. Yummy DK really just pulling the back end because it is important to have someone who slides in the black back door and takes takes over those buildings that are not being attended attended to. Um, but I personally would have liked to see us focus more on holding the crystals early on and, and reinforcing whenever they took a rally because they were not stacking rallies. And even stacking rallies, no one can do it perfect. 
so let's say they they have a rally and there's 10 seconds in between well that rally hits we reinforce in speed by the time that second rally hits and they lose more than we do so i'm just digging around and uh scouting stuff but i think we got about one minute left it's fourteen thousand troops <laughs> All my troops are out. They're defending. Uh, I don't know. I, I pulled back from something. I don't know one of my troops. Maybe they took, an, uh, took a building. He's trying to attack the Blessing Tower. DK's got it locked down. I'm like, you know, let me get rid of this freaking fire. It's annoying. <laughs> mm. They took the turret. We took it right back. Look at that. Okay, we're 100 ahead with 20 seconds left. Well done, team. We, we, you know, we started off rough. We didn't have a good plan, but we pulled it together. We held, and there's the win. Now, they had, they had more castles than us. Um, they had legendary, uh, um, a higher average of legendary as well. But you can tell that some of them did not put the effort into stats. And we got the win. So there it is. Great job, team. Anyway, I hope you like this video. Uh, I will be putting up more, uh, hopefully, each round in the future. I'm just going to let it play out here. And But that's the end of it. So stick around and give me a subscribe to see the next Field of Honors and how it plays out. I'm the Strategic Gamer, and I hope it helps.